Alright, what's up guys? And in this video, we're going to be talking about um, the, the, the New Year's event and how you can prepare for it and what I think the, the reskin is going to be between Bum Puff and Nembit. So I actually have them in my party right here. So if you if you figure out what these Lumis look like, here here's like a little glimpse of them. Um, just in case you might have forgot, like, if you haven't played for a while or something, I don't know what the case may be. This is Ambit, and that's and that's Bump Puff. I think it's going to be Ambit because it's the, the the year of the rabbit. This is is what the the, the thing is based off of for, for this New Year's event. This year of the rabbit or the or the bunny. So Ambit would be perfect for this. Um, it would also be it would also make the most sense because like this is the first time they've ever done like these th this kind of event. So what better way to introduce the first encounterable um, starter reskin? And this would also be a good time to uh, also have an excuse to, to uh, re remodel Ambit. Because if you guys didn't know, which I'm sure most of you have known, um, Twiddle and its evolution line were the first Lumians to ever get a model, like a model um, redesign. Correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, huh. I, I thought I had this in my... Where, where did I put them? I had Seer Knight and uh, Rabbit in here, but I don't know where they went. Okay, anyways, whatever. Uh, the point is, uh, everyone, I think everyone can agree on me to a certain extent that Ambit and its evolution line models are kind of not good. They're fine. They, they, they were fine back then when the, when the game first came out. Like, you know, it, it was whatever. But I think now it would be the perfect time to uh, maybe make its uh, remodeled debut for the event as well. And um, yeah, I'll, now I'll be talking about how you can prepare for this event. Now, um, for reskins, I'm sure everyone knows this, but for reskins, they do sometimes have gamma forms. Uh, sometimes they're alpha alpha forms and they and the gamma lock, but most reskins have gamma forms, which means you have to do the mastery for them. Now, I'm gonna be honest. Most people by now should have the starter masteries, but I'll go over the masteries, show, show you what they look like and what the challenges are. And honestly, guys, they're not that hard. So you go in here. So here's the Ambit Mastery. Uh, discover all evolutionary stages. For this one, you can probably just go to like Atlantean City, uh, that guy, the, the trainer in the blue shirt, and just, or, or you could trade for some power fruits. I think. Seer Knight evolves at level 32 or 36, or Red Bird gets to Seer Knight 32, 36. The same thing with experience. You can do these two basically at the same time. You could do actually all these at the same time. Um, Power Fruits again, if you have anyone that has them, ask, you know, it, or just grind. You could also use the, um, the, the Lumi Boost. Don't be afraid to use the Lumi Boost, but if you're saving it, if you're saving your boosts, then Maybe you don't want to do that, so it, it, it's really up to you if you want it to be as fast as fast as possible. Again, you you only have like you guys only have like basically a day to, to prepare because the event's probably gonna release Saturday like like evening or something. Well, I guess you have a little bit more time than that. All of Friday and then whatever is left for uh, Saturday. Um, rally 50. This one's gonna be kind of annoying actually. You might want to actually use the rally boost for this. There is a rally boost. So, you can use XP boost, rally boost, you know, whatever it takes, but like... Like I said, if you want to be boost efficient, like, if you, if you don't want to use boost, then it would probably be best to just, like, wait it out. But also, um, yeah. Knockout 30, this one's pretty easy. You can just go to, like, a low-level area and just literally knock out three things with, like, Seer Knight or something. And, uh, for, for Bun Puff, uh, I actually don't know where that is. None of the icons are loading. Okay, here we go. Bump up. Okay. Our experience. Again, this one's pretty straightforward. Two, 2,000 damage. For this one, personally, you can ask a friend that has like really tanky Lumians. You can just go into Battle Coliseum. Uh, it's pretty easy. It doesn't take much effort to do that. Knock up five Lumians if I can move. Like I said, you can just go to ran like a low level area. Personally, I, how I did this one is I went to Midas Town, which is the town that you spawn in like when you start the game 
and you get a you get a Baneki or a Bunpuff, and you just use um I think it has grass moves at early level, so you can just kill a bunch of gobbies in that low level area. Uh, if you have the fishing rod, of course. Um, if not, then Route Five, you know where the pagoda is. You can kill some bad boars, and uh, Rakwal is there. Rally Twenty is also straightforward. So, uh, and then the last thing I want to talk about is boost tokens, which I was already talking about for those other things, but this one's just for the, the Gleam guns. Um, if you want to use roaming in Gleam, you can, but there most likely won't be a reskin realm. If there is, then that's going to be really annoying, and that's going to probably be a bad thing for the event. But if you want to use both, you can. You don't have to in this event, though. You can do full on Gleaming boost. That's what I'm going to do. I am not touching Rome boost. I was using Rome boost for all of December. So yeah, if if, if you want to be boost efficient, then ju just go with this one. Also, get your pity down to one if you if you really care about that. I'm not gonna get my pity down to one because there is a chance that you can get an alpha before your pity, and it, that that will reset it back to 128. So yeah, that's that's basically it. I mean. This is all optional, like this part of the video is really optional, like boost tokens, like you don't have to do any of this stuff, like hunting is only like, you know, like you don't have to hunt for it, you can just catch a normal reskin one and then just call it a day. But if you really want to go for that value, because I honestly think that this uh, end bit or whatever it is will be very valuable in the future, uh, that's just me, I don't know if anyone else feels that way. But um. Yeah, honestly, I think I got all of the, all, all. I think I got over all the points that I um, wanted to talk about. Um, if you want more informational videos like this, this is my first time doing this. If you want more videos like this, let me know. And uh, yeah, I wish you guys luck for the event. Uh, I might, I might like record some hunting sessions. Sorry if the FPS is really bad here. I, I yeah, it was working fine until now. Um, might do some recording section sessions of like hunting but other than that uh that's basically it all right i'll see you guys later peace